he's been our best player all, all, all season and such an important member. We'd, we'd love to have him running out every week. Um, you know, however, you know, we accept the punishment that's been given. Um, Toby himself has, you know, shown remorse, um, obviously, to for his actions and, and to the umpire for his actions. And and you just, you know, just simply can't do that in our game. And, and we hold the umpires in such high regard and 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 treat them with a lot of respect. So. Um, definitely disappointed he won't be running out with us, but we have to accept that um, it's not allowed in our game. Yeah, look, I, I think it's more, you know, we've got a, obviously a game in, in 48 hours to really prepare now and put a lot of our energy into, and we'll be out, with, we'll be out um, for the next few weeks with, without Toby, so that's something for us probably um, in, in, in a little bit to, to work on um, post this game or anything like that. Um, we need to put all our energy into that, and, and yesterday, to, to be fair, as everyone would have been, um, you know, reading, following what was happening with the um, with, with the tribunal uh, case. We actually, you know, f had to go on the bus and, and travelled an hour and a half down, and then flew across to, to Perth. So yesterday was a was it was a big day for everyone, big travel day. So um, everyone was pretty tired once we got in and, and main training today and prepare for the game. You know, obviously a, a vice captain for for a reason, and um, you know he's uh, obviously disappointed um, in, in himself and disappointed that he won't be able to play. But you know, even this morning and. Um, uh, he's right back up and his energy's back up and he'll, you know, especially for a few of our younger players, you know, I think we had seven or eight guys playing in their first final uh, last week. He's got, you know, so much experience and um, just having him around the group, whether it be in training today or just in conversations around it, he'll, he'll play a part in that for sure. It was a tough game, uh, difficult conditions and, and we knew coming up against Sydney it was going to be that way. So our uh, body feels good. Um, yeah, really just can't wait for... Um, you know, for Friday night and, um, you know, yesterday was a you know, big travelling day for us. So today will be about recovering and, and, and getting training done and then really looking forward to, you know, tomorrow and the, and the build up to such a massive game for us. Yeah, no, no doubt that it's a massive game, but I, I, I just think the whole season for us, it's been one of, you know, facing, you know, a lot of adversity, whether it be through injury or, you know, suspensions here and there or moving away from Sydney, being on the, being on the road now for, for 10 weeks. We've really seeked and, and found energy off off that and, and, and really uh, our last month has shown that, our last five weeks since that Port Adelaide game has shown uh, that we're just loving you know, whatever's thrown at our face. We, we went down to Geelong last time with a very undermanned side and uh, our last few weeks have been you know, phenomenal from a um, you know, performance point of view but just for a, you know, camaraderie amongst the group and, and energy that's been infected, a, um, whoever runs out has, has been a, you know, a real a real, you know, for me anyway, as captain, seeing that and seeing, you know, what we couldn't do last year compared to what we're doing now is really special. We'll be full of confidence again, as we have over the last four or five weeks, um, knowing they're a strong outfit, they're a very experienced outfit, being there before in finals, but, you know, so have we. And the, the prospect of playing Friday night um, in front of a packed up the stadium here in Perth is one that we're really looking forward to.